Okay, we're back at Emil, and we're, let's enter. Okay, now I realised last time that I came here, I forgot to get the chest that was uh, up there. So uh, let's get that. Uh, as long as I remember which way to go, is would always be a good thing. Uh, yeah, pretty simple. I hope. Better be. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's alright. Dude! Oh, come on, game. Yeah, I'm totally messing this up. Ah, there we go. Got it. At last. And I think this is another vial. Yeah, it is. Oh, I know this game too well. I know, I know all the individual treasures and everything now. If I examine one of these graves, do they give me anything? Yeah, lucky metal. Uh, I want to go to the item store and sell some of that my uh, excess off if I can. If it's not open, oh well, yeah, it is open. Sell. Wow, look at all the stuff we got from those uh, from that grinding we did. Yeah, just sell all of those. And vials, I don't think are rare. No, they're not. Yeah, get rid of all the rubbish. You definitely want to keep your inventory clear in this game, because, uh, well, you don't get a lot of space. And that potion, even though it fully heals you, is not worth it. Uh, sell the travel vest, that's redundant now. And uh, yeah, that's pretty good. Now, we can't use the weapons store or the arm store yet, because they're both freezing their asses off. Uh, but to activate the story events, I want to talk to this lad here. Are you to email? Yes. Should one of the around, trying not to catch it. Now, you have to go to the sanctuary here, and you want to talk to this girl. Have you visited the old couple? No. Maya went to their house. You might have seen her if you stopped there. Right. So now we want to go to the old uh, to this house here, and we see Maya. She's using ply. This looks like a uh, sun energy to me, which is awesome. And ply is a uh, is a really good spell actually. Very useful. It's gonna make life a lot easier. Yeah, Mia, you're awesome. Don't even mess. She's possibly like one of my favorite characters in the entire series of games of Golden Sun. I, I think she's amazing. She's got a great selection of like armors and weapons and things. It's just oh, it's amazing. Yeah, I know it's spoilers, but you could pretty much guess that she was gonna join us eventually. And what the hell was that flash? Oh, so that tower up there is a lighthouse. Oh, I didn't know that. Alex, who's Alex? All right. First thing we want to do is, of course, we want to loot the area. We get an empty bottle, an exceedingly important item. Do not forget to get that. Otherwise, you won't be able to progress with the story. And that would be very bad. So now we want to enter Mercury Lighthouse. Now this place is definitely, definitely, definitely one of my favourite places in the entire game. I love this place. I love the music. I love the way it's designed. I love just pretty much everything about this place. Yeah, I can hear it. Alex and I are the only one who can enter Mercury Lighthouse. Right. Yeah, and there's a statue blocking your way. And wouldn't you know, we have powers. Yeah, move that out the way. Did you do that? Yeah, we sure did. I knew it. I saw a ghost of force pushing it. You can see us using Synergy? It's synergy, love. Synergy. I don't care what how it was developed, it's synergy. Some of the people are there, don't you think? Yep, sure does. They're very similar. Yeah, we know, we know. 
and we'll we'll try and help you along the way. Man, that is awesome. Yeah, the, the game designers are just amazing. I love Camelot for this game. Camelot, you are amazing. And that lizard man seems to be giving my trouble. So what do we say we'd be chivalrous, us three lads, and help out the uh, the woman in need? I think we should. Let's dominate this guy. Yeah, and this new enemy, the lizard man, he can be pretty tough if you're under level, just like Trek. But we're not, so he should be no problem at all. Especially if you stun him. That makes life a hell of a lot easier. Yeah, no problem. Yeah. Oh, you're gonna run away from us? Yeah, no, not even thank you, huh? Yeah, well, get lost then. Right, we're just gonna come and stalk you anyway. Yeah, don't bother with the left exit just yet. We will get to that later. But for now, we need to go through the right exit. And up these stairs. Where we find Maya again, stuck in need, and the men come to her rescue once more, because we're amazing. Yeah, we saved you again. Do you have business in the last house too? Yes, we do. I'm sure there will be more places ahead that I cannot pass alone. Yeah, and we can't pass without you either. Yeah, well, we're not of the American kind, what are you going to do about it? Oh, we're special. Well, you can trust us. Yeah, definitely. And we get Maya. Maya is the last character we get in this game, and she's possibly one of my favourites. She starts off with one Legion, Fizz, who heals HP, and her equipment, although not amazing, is pretty useful at this point. She has a Witch's Wand, Leather Gloves, Wooden Cap, pretty much all the best stuff you could buy in the shop to begin with. So we currently have two Wizard Wands, a Broadsword, and an Elven Rapier going, which is not too bad. So yeah, that's uh, that's some pretty good going there. She's got a couple of extraneous items that we're never going to use, but yeah, you take what you can get. She's pretty powerful. When we get her second Legion in here, she'll uh, match the lads, and she'll be superior in physical attack to Ivan. She'll have greater physical uh, healing capabilities than Isaac, and she's just an all-round great character to have in your party. You definitely want to keep her alive. Now, some of these waterfalls. Uh, I think it's this one. You can pass through the waterfalls, and I can't remember which ones it is. Uh, uh, nothing new here. See you in a moment. Yeah, more meaningless fights, but all well. That's what an RPG does to you. Now we come to the first puzzle of this uh, area. What you have to do is you have to push the pipe in the water there, which forces it to come here. You get blown across. You then come underneath the stairs. Now there's a treasure chest there. We definitely want to get that. But we can't get it while the water's going. So what we have to do is we have to get shoved by the water first. If it walk up there, doesn't really matter. Then we need to come under here. Now what we need to do is we need to walk underneath these stairs all the way across. And we need to push the pipe out again. Which allow now allows us to go through without the pipe being there. Which is uh, always good. And if I could get my direction straight would be uh, exceedingly handy in these circumstances in a dungeon. And we get our first chest of Mercury Lighthouse, and it is a Psy Crystal. Essentially, that's a Sandage Stone that's carryable in your inventory. Uh, not useless, but not exactly amazingly useful either. Now, can I remember which way I must go now? That is the question. Prob uh, seemingly not. Let's go back over here. Please, no random encounters. Please, no random encounters. Please, no random encounters. Is it back up there? No, surely not. No random encounters, no random Ah, this way, this is the way, this is the way. This is the way. Beautiful. Just beautiful. Yeah. Now, we want to come out this way. Uh, because that way you just become stuck anyway. And here we have... Oh, well, it's not a new enemy, but we might as well show him anyway and show off our new character, Maya. She has Ice Synergy, and she also has Ply, which heals for 100 HP, which is seemingly useful. She also has Cure Poison, though no, we've met any uh, poison-inflicting enemies at this point in the game, but eventually we will, so it's exceedingly useful. And here we have Ice. She, her Synergy isn't the most powerful, but her healing Synergy more than makes up for her, her offensive uh, downfalls. 
And I'm definitely not going to show all this, so I'm just going to cut me pushing this all the way to the end. Okay, we push the statue in onto the button there, so what we have to do now is jump down here, run up here, and go through this door. But what will we find down this chasm? What happens if we slide down there? Will we find exceedingly large amounts of water? Or will we find random encounters? Find out next time on Let's Play Golden Sun. And man, these fights are annoying, so I'll see you next time.